Hello, lover. How are you? I'm glad. Um, right now I'm sitting in a messy room and I am waiting to be picked up to go out for the night. It's, it's kind of surreal knowing that I'm leaving so soon. I'm leaving Monday to come see you. That is so exciting. And it's, I'm ready to go right now. If everything was packed up and it was Monday and it was, but it was today, like I'm ready to get in the car and go. I'm ready to be with you. I'm ready so much. I, I don't care about anything else, which is not good. It's, it's not bad. Actually, it's probably more bad than, I don't know. Is it good? Is it bad? I think it's good. Feels good. <laughs> I don't care. Um, I love you. Very much. I'm just packing everything. I feel like I got a lot of stuff to do, but I think when I start doing it, it won't take long. And because I've got everything planned out, there's not, I don't have a lot of stuff. Stuff. I just got a lot of clothes and a lot of bed stuff, like pillows, blankets, you know. So I think that's what's going to be the big bulk. I think I'm going to put my fridge in the front seat and fill the trunk up with clothes. I really think that that is... I think if I fill the trunk up with my clothes, which I'm pretty confident in being able to do, and then any boxes of odds and ends, which I've already filled up one box of odds and ends. I'm going to have about one more boxes, one more box of odds and ends. Uh, put those in the trunk with the clothes, and then in the back seat I'll have my books and my bedware, my bass guitars. I think my amp is, my bass amp is going to go in the back as well. And then that'll put my fridge in the front, beds in the back. And then that's where I'll sleep, in the back. I'll put my bass guitars in the front seats with them folded forward so you can't really see them. Um, and then I'll sleep in the back seat with plenty of room, plenty of blankets and pillows. You know how many pillows and blankets I got. I'm going to be comfy. I'll, be, I'll, I'll sleep better in the back of my car than I'd probably sleep at anyone's guest house. And since we're not really getting... A lot of help in that department, which is fine. It's kind of a last-minute suggestion, but since we're not getting much help with the guests keeping me up for the night, then that's fine. So I'm going to sleep in the car. I'm going to sleep safely. I'm going to drive safely. Uh, if I get sleepy, I'm going to pull over. There's no point in trying to fight being sleepy. None. And my big trick as you know, was to smoke cigarettes on road trips, but I quit smoking cigarettes, so I don't know what I'm going to do to replace that, because cigarettes were so great on a road trip. Just get tired, get tired, light a cigarette, and you're good to go. You got fresh air, you got not fresh air, and you've got a stimulant, so you're good to go. But now, I'm not going to have that, so I don't know. I know I smoked a lot of cigarettes when I drove that, that eight hours, seven to eight hours straight. That was a lot of cigarettes that I smoked. Um, and and moving isn't really a good reason for me to start smoking, even if it is literally just for the duration of the trip. I don't think that's a good enough reason. So let me know if you think of anything that I can do. Um, let's see. Anyways, uh, I love you. I love you. I'm hopefully going to be home soon tonight. Heather doesn't want to stay out late, and to be honest, neither do I, so I'm going to... I still need to pick Liam up at 1.30. Uh, I, just want, I just don't want to be there late at the, at the event, show, place thing. Anyways, I love you love you very much and I'm excited to see you finally well not finally but finally be with you because as soon as I get there I don't ever have to leave you and I don't plan on it I love you